Okay guys, that's something I want to show you which I've made for myself as I'm doing a lot of shooting at night lately. I uh, have this little torch. Uh, it's screwed on, drilled in. Two screws in each side. Uh, it's very sturdy. Uh, the torch is plenty bright enough as it was on an headlamp and I've used it quite a few times. Um, I don't think you need the torch too powerful to be honest. You can spot rabbits and pheasants in the dark with this up to 45-50 feet. So uh, it's more than powerful enough for what I use and um, I wouldn't want a really powerful beam anyway, just draw attention to yourself and um, scare the animals off. So my personal experience is just a dim beam like this, uh, I wouldn't want it any powerful at. Uh, the catapult I've got it on is one of my Pocket Rocket 2's, uh, as you can see. From there is the Pocket Rocket 2, that's my favourite out the range, that's all I shoot. Uh, as you can see, the grip like that. Whether you're shooting sideways or like that, um, you should be able to uh, focus on whatever I'm shooting at, hopefully, as you can see. So, um, can't wait to try this, I've been doing a lot more hunting at night recently, as there's plenty of rabbits about at night. So uh, I'll get this banded up with a set of my gamekeeper bands in a bit and uh, I'll give it a tester tonight. Uh, I won't be bringing these out or anything but uh, I suppose I could make the odd one or two to order but uh, bear in mind I'd have to order the lights and uh, it'll take a week or so to get made. So um, that's it really folks, just thought I'd show you this. Uh, my Pocket Rocket 2, uh, the Night Hunter. As I say, this light is plenty bright enough for what I use it for. I wouldn't want it any brighter. Uh, spot rabbits from 40, 50 feet. Uh, you can even spot them from further, but I wouldn't shoot from any further than 40, 50 feet, to be honest. So, um, should be brilliant, this. Uh, I did have it on a headlamp before, but the problem is when I had it on the headlamp, I, when I shoot, I look to the right. When looking to the left, I couldn't really hold the, um, the catapult and bring my bands back to the right hand side of me while still looking, it was a bit awkward. So I think this has solved the problem of all the getting my hands tangled up and trying to keep my head in the right place with the light. So, uh, can't wait to go and try it, I'll try and get out tonight, if not tonight I'll get out tomorrow. So now uh, see how it goes. Cheers.